Welcome to Cook Plants and Decor Kitchen. In today's video, we are making the best chicken tender and crispy. And to get this done, we are using the Ninja Foodie pressure cooker that also crisps. If you don't know me, I'm Idania. This is Cook Plants and Decor, my channel. I do cooking videos, gardening videos, and decorating videos. So if you are visiting me today, I am inviting you to subscribe to my channel. In today's video, we are going to review this guy here. Let's look at all the functions that this amazing Ninja Foodie have. Pressure, as we mentioned it before. It's also steam, slow cook, make yogurt, sear, saute, dehydrate, broil, bake, roast, air crisp, and keep warm. It's like everything in once. What else do we need to make our life easier? You will get the pressure cooker lid and the air fryer lid. This one is attached to the Ninja Foodie and cannot be removed. So will be there every time that you use it. The pressure cooker lid is easy to recognize. It's a standard with the silicone, like the one that you use every day, and it's not attached to the Ninja Foodie. And to seal the pressure cooker lid, just line up the tooth arrow and follow the arrows. Let's take a look at this nice and very wide non-stick ball. You're gonna use this every time that you use your Ninja Fuji. Because there is a pressure sensor here in the middle of the Ninja Fuji that when you place the ball, will press it down and will be activated. I got this rack. I will be using it for almost everything. I didn't get the basket. I will get it at Amazon. There are so many accessories there that you can get. For now, I think I'm only gonna get the basket. I don't want to get so many accessories that at the end, I don't wanna use it. This rack is reversible. You can put it down to be closer to the heat where I can place like the whole chicken, or you can reverse it and place any flat food like a chicken breast or any vegetable that can fix it. It also comes with this amazing book. A lot of recipe inside that you can make it at home. Have all nice pictures. It's telling you how to use the air fryer, how to cook a whole chicken. It's very good. I'm encourage you to use it, especially if you are not cooking every day, that you are not used too much to the kitchen. Use this book, it will help you. And it's time for cooking. And for my first review, I'm going to cook this whole chicken. Will be juicy and crispy. The first thing we're gonna do is to marinate the chicken. And for the marinade, these are the ingredients. One third cup of extra virgin olive oil, one tablespoon of chicken seasoning, one tablespoon of garlic powder, one tablespoon of lemon pepper, one tablespoon of black pepper, two tablespoons of teriyaki, one packet of azafran goya, one lemon juice. We are going to marinate our chicken that is already defrosted and cold. I put it in the fridge and it's very dry. So I'm going to give it a good massage inside and out. And for even more flavor, I'm placing on the bottom of the pot garlic, onion, and thyme. Now I'm placing the chicken on the rock with the breast facing up. I just put in the rest of the marinade on top of it. We're gonna turn on the Ninja Pudding. 
We're gonna press some pressure and the time will be 22 to 25 minutes for the book. And I'm gonna add 25 minutes because I like it well done. And then press start. And that's it, just wait to the end. 25 minutes pass, the pressure went out naturally and the chicken is looking like this. It's well cooked and smell amazing. Now it's time to crisp the skin. Just place the air fryer top. Turn on the Ninja food again. Press air crispy. And the time will be eight to 18 minutes. Okay. Okay, let's reveal the chicken. <laughs> I set it off for 18 minutes. The manual said eight to 18. So because I like it very crispy, I put it to 18. I check it when it was about 10 minutes. You can see the skin very, it's golden, very it's beautiful. But this area here, it burned a little bit. The skin it was touching the top of the lid. It's fine. It's looking good anyway. Okay. It actually looked like a decoration there. <laughs> okay, now we're going to taste it. But before, I'm going to show you all the use that is under this bird. You know, after it's done, I wait until it gets warm before I lift it, okay? Look all the juice. Oof. You can make a gravy or you can just leave it as a stock, chicken stock, or make a soup. I think I'm gonna make a soup. Let me taste the flavor. Delicious. Okay, well now it's time to taste the bird. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's try. Let's see. Ooh, juicy. It's very juicy. Mm. I don't want to cut the whole piece. But Oh, guys, look at this. So you see. Mm. Juicy. <laughs> and the skin is crispy. Only it's not too crispy, but you're not gonna eat all the skin anyway. It's so good. Mm. Okay, guys, see you in my next video. I hope that you enjoyed this one because I did. This Ninja Fuji pressure and air fryer is very convenient. You can even cook one dinner at once. You can put rice on the bottom and the meat on top. And that rice will be cooked with all the juice of that meat that will be so perfect and so flavorful. But for today, I will say bye bye because I'm going to continue eating my piece of chicken. <laughs> See you in my next videos.